What's up? Today we're under my Honda and we're going to check out the inner joint on the CV axle. This is the passenger side. So I'm not an expert on CV joints, but I do believe that I can show you how to find out if your CV axle is bad. First you want to do is put pressure on the inside part because the inside part has a little bit of play in it. And then you're going to grab the shaft and move it and see if there's any movement. You can hear a little clicking. There's movement on that side. They can move in and out like this, but they shouldn't be able to move side to side like this. So if, if, I, if you grab it without touching this part, this big body piece, the whole thing will move. So if you put pressure right here, pushing up, then you can grab the shaft and find the play in it. I don't know if that made any sense. All right, now we're on the driver's side. We're gonna do the same procedure. There's a, there's a little bit of play in this. I'm told that's okay. Like I said, I'm not an expert. So I'm gonna grab this, put pressure up top, grab the CV axle shaft, see if I can move it. There is zero movement. It can go in and out, but it shouldn't be able to go side to side. So I'd say this axle is tip top. Trying really hard, nothing. Okay, so I'm usually not one to film and drive, but I kind of need it for this demonstration. Light is green, it's clear. Okay, so you get it's a bad inner joint on your CV axle. It feels like you're getting wheel hop when you're accelerating. So as I'm going, I don't know if you can just tell the steering wheel is moving. It's going da -da 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 -da, like this. <laughs> if that makes any sense. It kind of feels like I have a bad strut, and now that I know that the axle on the driver uh, passenger side is the one that's bad, I can really feel that the vibration is coming from that end of the car. So I accelerate a little bit, and it's going like this. It's like I have a bad strut, or that I'm getting wheel hop. Is how I how I explain the feeling. I know my suspension, everything's all good, pretty much all brand new. And I have a great alignment, new tires, so the wheels are not bent, so I've deduced it to a bad inner joint on my CV axle passenger side. Good luck with your projects, your car. 